Hello siblings, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you guys some last minute at home DIY costume ideas of just stuff you could have around your house. I'm going to try some on for you and then just give you some ideas. If you guys didn't know, I'm sick, I have COVID and my quarantine will be like just about to be over at Halloween but I'm staying home on Halloween so I don't know if I'll dress up or not. I don't know if I'll like do something at home or go live or something but I thought it'd be fun to make this video since I am not actually doing anything on Halloween. This is my way to participate in the Halloween spirit so I hope you guys enjoy and get some good ideas. If you do, make sure to thumb hit thumbs up and Let's go. So I'm gonna start with what was actually supposed to be my costume this year, which was Kim Possible. If you have orange hair, this is definitely an option. It's super easy. You just need some green army pants, a little fanny pack, and a black long sleeve crop top. I am obsessed with this outfit, and I am so sad that I wasn't able to wear it where I was supposed to wear it and be Kim Possible this year. But it's also a super easy, quick costume if you need something last minute. So this is a pirate. Pirate is one of my absolute favorite go-to costumes. I think I've been a pirate a couple of times because it's just so easy and yet so fun and customizable because you can add braids and headbands and jewelry. And as long as you're wearing something that kind of looks like ruggedy and old, then it's gonna pass for a pirate. I absolutely love pirate costumes. So here I was going for school girl, but I was thinking more like gossip girl uniform, like Serena gossip girl. If I didn't, if I had a tie, I think it would have tied all in or like a vest or something, but I love this costume. I actually thought this was a really cute outfit too. Maybe I'd just wear it out and about. I don't know, let me know what you think, but little gossip girl moment. So I have this and I thought this would be the perfect idea of a park ranger for a costume. The only thing I'm missing is a hat. If I had a hat or could obtain one, this would be such a good, easy, simple costume and still really cute. I have this black really long dress and it kind of just reminds me of like secret agents or like spies in the movies and they like, you know, keep their weapon on their hip and then they like pull it out from under their dress. So that was giving me those kind of vibes, secret agent, I don't know. So if you have a black dress, you could obviously dress it up and make it into something like that, which is simple and fun and cute. Something that is always laying around the house is an 80s workout costume. All you need is some colorful stuff. Obviously I have this jacket that everyone might not have, but you can do this with a colorful shirt. If you're doing like the shorts over the leggings, maybe add some leg warmers or just long socks. Such a simple, easy costume to do at home. So this costume, I had a couple ideas. One, it could just be like a dad. You could also just do like cargo shorts or something along those lines and then add like tennis shoes and make it just like super dad vibes. I thought that'd be a funny last minute costume. But what I really had in mind was a lumberjack, but for some reason, I guess I got rid of all of my flannels because I could not find them anywhere in my house. But if you do a flannel and some jeans, you could easily pull off being a lumberjack, which is cute, easy, last minute. And then we have this outfit that is just black and red, which you can make so many things out of black and red. You know, it could be what first came to my mind is vampire. You just got to add the blood to the face, do the makeup, all that. You could also do like a devil sort of costume or maybe even like a witch. Anything that involves those like darker red blacks you can throw together as a cute outfit to make a bunch of different things. Now this looks super basic. I didn't want to do the makeup, but if you wear just like anything brown, you could also add like a brown skirt, you could do a brown dress, whatever it is. You could be a deer and it's super cute with the makeup. It might be a little basic, but hey, we're at the last minute range, okay? We don't have time to not be basic. Gotta be honest here. Most of these costumes are all in the makeup, so as long as you're wearing, you know, a cute outfit and add that makeup, it's gonna look like a Halloween costume. So that's all the costumes that I'm gonna try on, but I do have some more ideas, but I just didn't have the stuff to do it. So one I thought would actually be such a good idea, I have these pants that would have worked really well, but I didn't have like a good, like flowy or like tie-dye something, but you could be a hippie and do flowy pants, tie-dye shirt, sunglasses, and that one's super easy. Another idea I had, I didn't want to try this on because I didn't know how to make it um, presentable because this is see-through, but you could use some sort of like lingerie like this, dress it up more, and be like a fairy, or any sort of just like sparkly or mystical looking dress. 
Of course, you can always just wear all black, paint your face, be a skeleton, or even wear something like this. Dead anything. I mean, if you have a plain white shirt, what I did when I was in high school and I had no ideas was cut up a shirt, put blood on it, be like a dead girl, or you could be a dead bride, or dead literally anything. Just add blood to a cute outfit and you can make it a dead something. You could do more of like a modern witch look, like literally this kind of outfit. Maybe wear a witch hat or just do cool makeup. A lot of the stuff you can just wear clothes and then do makeup and it becomes costume a scarecrow wear like farmer clothes and then do makeup cupid if you just wear all red and then you could somehow get some like diy wings or bow that would work and then of course like an angel or the devil if you're doing like a best friend costume or something like that so that's kind of like all my halloween ideas with what you can do at home last minute um i hope you guys enjoyed this and i hope you guys all have a super fun halloween because i'm gonna be here at home by myself i might still dress up maybe do a vlog of like Halloween alone or something like that. Maybe I'll go live on TikTok. I don't know. So stay tuned. Maybe I'll play video games. Oh, I could do like a costume stream. That could be fun. I did that last year. So let me know if you guys want to hang out on Halloween with me virtually. <laughs> I love you guys so much and I will see you in the next one. Bye.